Welcome to this lecture. In this lecture, we'll get to know the interface of the Adobe Premiere Pro. If you have never used the Premiere Pro, then this lecture is very important for you. Because when we are familiar with something, then it is very easy to work with that. Okay. And if you already know the interface of the Adobe Premiere Pro, then you can skip this lecture and you can go to the next lecture. All right. So let me just quickly start over here. As you can see, this is the main menu options. So here we have the option to file and we have we can save it. We can create a new project. We can create open project. We can open the recent projects. OK, and all these options like we can import the files and all these are options over here. Here we have the options to edit like copy, cut, paste, clear. Here we have the options for working on the clip. Here we have the option to use uh, different settings on the sequence and other options like render audio selection, all these things. These are little advanced options. So there we have the options to manage our markers. We can put marker and title windows and all these windows. Here we have the option to show like if I check this e history, it is going to show up the history over here as you can see. And if I uncheck it, it is going to remove it from here as well. All right. Okay. And here we have the help option. So this is a just quick look. And over here, as you can see, this is our source clip. Okay. So this is the Premiere Pro project. All right. So if we import some media we can just double click it over here and let's say if i bring in this media and now it would be placed over here okay if i choose this icon view then i can see the preview of this video okay and if i hover my mouse over it i can play it okay so what is in it i can get to know and if i just double click it then it would appear here on the source panel so i can just play and i can scrub through with this option okay so this is a play head here we have the options other options play options so this is for the source okay and here we have the effects control so i can if i create like want to create a sequence out of it i can click and drag it over here and a sequence would be created and if i select this clip now we have the option to control its position scale okay so i can control of all of that with the help of effects control i can even manage the volume okay and all these opacity so i can do everything with the help of effects control panel okay and on the next panel is effects panel here we have all the presets like audio effects or video transition video effects and other options of color presets if you have saved any or these are the color presets okay so you can choose anything from here and here we have the option to manage our audio of this clip okay so we can manage with the increase the volume we can increase or decrease the volume with the help of this and here we have the metadata all right so metadata is basically the basic information about this clip okay as you can see is this movie is of 29.85 frame per second and its media ends on one minute 53 seconds and 20 milliseconds all right so all these options or these informations is of uh, informations are available over here and over here this is the main window okay so whatever we'll be editing we'll see and look at this window and we'll do the editing and here we have again play option and these options to go to next frame and go to out point if i create like in point and then out point okay then it can show me the in point and out point i can go back to in point so all these options are here once we'll start working on that we'll get to know all these things okay